paper hearts but i know this beat is yours hey guys d field here and welcome back to another minecraft video i hope you guys are feeling freaking fantastic this weekend it is currently monday and um i'm still feeling sick man you guys probably have school and stuff right now but like the sickness that i've been having for the past week has just been sticking around you guys can probably hear it in my voice i wake up and it takes like five hours for my voice to like just wake up and like get back into what it's supposed to sound like but i've got like a stuffy nose a little bit of uh like my fever's gone so i don't have that fever anymore but uh I, you know i hope you guys are feeling better than i am honestly i hate this feeling i hate the feeling of just being sick man like you literally just can't do anything against it and it's the most annoying freaking thing ever but anyways I hope you guys are having a fantastic start to the week, and I hope you guys are just feeling a lot better, man. Do it for me, dude. Have a good week for me, man. Like, I'm just not having the best of weeks right now. But anyways, welcome back. Oh my gosh, my voice. I hate my voice right now, dude. <laughs> guys, if you hate when your voice is like this, hit that like button right now, man. It would really help a lot, dude. Oh, I'm just... I'm, it's frustrating, man. It's honestly freaking frustrating. I wish I could just have a normal voice right now. But anyways... Um, I know you guys might have already heard about the, um, the, the lottery this week. Like, on Saturday, I think, in the U.S., the Powerball lottery just drew for a record of 800 million freaking dollars. Yeah, dude, like, what the frick? What the hell would you do if you won 800 million dollars from the lottery? Like, be honest, dude. Like, I honestly would not even know where to begin when it came, actually, I lied. I probably wouldn't know where I would begin if I if I had or if I did win the lottery for that much money. Like I I would have a set plan for myself on what I would do. But obviously, like, what would you guys do if you had the opportunity to win eight hundred million dollars? What would you guys do first, and why? Now, for me personally, like I had a little bit of a thought. Um, like before this. Before this episode started, before I started recording this episode, I was like, what the heck would I do with $800 million? And obviously, I think it's actually, the, the lottery is actually up to $1.2 billion now that they're going to be drawing on freaking, um, when is it, like Wednesday, I think? So it's kind of freaking interesting. Like, what would you do if you had that much money? Like, and then I thought about it myself, and I was like, you know what? I would probably just... I would probably just do what I would normally do and actually just, um, what is it called? I would probably, first of all, I would probably invest in something, you know, like I would, here's the thing guys, you gotta realize that the more money you have, the easier it is for you to make even more money, if that makes any sense. So basically, if you have, you know, if you have all that money, you literally could work, like you could, you, you don't even need to work anymore, as long as you invest properly in the right things, like you could be set for life, if you get what I'm saying, man. Like, uh, um, a lot of people don't realize that and they would just go splurge and go all out and just be like, you know, I'd buy a Lamborghini and a huge mansion and I'd go on vacation here and here and here. But like, I, I don't know if I would do all that right away. Like the first thing that I think that I would actually do, first of all, like if I drew the lottery and I won a bajillion dollars, I would tell myself, to get a financial advisor. That'd be like the number one thing that I would do because obviously you're gonna need a little bit of help. You're gonna need a guy who knows exactly what they're doing with their life so that you can have the best chances of making sure you don't go bankrupt, you know what I'm saying? So like I would get a financial advisor first of all and then after that, I would probably just be like, you know what dude, I wanna not work for the rest of my life so that you, you, you just do the rest, you know what I'm saying? Like I'll be like, you figure out what I need to do as my fan financial advisor and I I'll listen to you because like I just want to not work for my like the rest of my life and I just want to be set because with that much money like it's still possible to go bankrupt with that much money you guys have to realize so you just got to be really smart with your money you know so like I would just be like yeah be smart with it and do exactly what I just said just be very very smart with it and um, just don't spend too much man so I'd get a financial advisor first of all, and then I would invest at least, at least half of that money directly back into the stock market right away. Now, basically, I'd probably hire, once again, because you'd have the money to, I'd hire the people that would know how to do that for me. So like, the people who do that as like their main job, I'd be like, yo, 
I need you to do, what do you call that, a stockbroker? I would hire a stockbroker to just manage stocks for me so that he's the one who makes the money. So now, after all that, you know, I'm thinking about it. I'm like, okay, so I'm set for life because I'm investing in stocks. I'm very smart with my investments and I know what I'm getting into. The next thing I would probably do would probably be, I would say, hmm, the next thing, like, I got to think about this. And the next thing I'd probably do is I would buy a house for my parents. Like, my parents have supported me through all these years, whether it's YouTube or whatever it may be. But, like, they've supported me through all this time, man. I think I think we could do it. I think we could figure out a way to, um, I think we could figure out a way to get them to help us or help them a little bit, whether it's, like, by buying them a house or by doing them whatever, you know? Like, it's going gonna, it's gonna to be very helpful. Um, and once you have that money, it's it's very easy to give back to your family. You know what I'm saying? I've got to knock back one sword, and it's really not helping my case because this guy is just running the frick away, and he's gonna try to re-engage and completely, utterly fail because I am a god at frickin' PV. Not really, okay, not really. Uh, but anyways, yeah. So I'd probably buy my parents a house, and then what would I do afterwards, man? I would probably. Whoa, where's this guy lagging? This guy's lagging up a storm right here, dude. What the heck? Hello? Hello? He's gonna die to his own frickin'. He's gonna die to his own frickin' la- What? Uh, okay. Oh my god, is, is he really lagging this badly? Dude, is Skywars lagging or is he lagging? What the frick is going on? I'm so- I'm so confused right now, bro. 55 seconds, let's get this stuff enchanted and get everything all made. Oh my gosh, what is freaking going on, man? But 1.2 billion dollars, just imagine. Now, some of you guys might ask, Mark, would you still be doing YouTube? If you had a, like that much money and uh, to be honest with you, I would I would still be doing YouTube I would still be doing twitch live streaming. You know what I'm saying? Because like I, I don't see the point in in quitting even though you like I'm not in it for the money man Honestly, like I'm really in it more for the fact where, where am I getting shot from? Who the heck is shooting me right now? There's a guy I think on this tree right here. Oh, he's got like a little bit of a fortress up here Oh, I see what you're doing there, dude. Are you serious right now, bro? Are you seriously gonna just camp up there? Like, a, okay, you you stay up there and do what you got to do, man. I'm just gonna I'm gonna win this game while you're freaking up there, man. I don't know why you would even be up there. We got poison pots. I got everything. All right, but yeah, man. I would I would still be doing YouTube a hundred percent. I would still most likely be you know just doing me. But like for the most part, like I would just I guess I would just be donating a whole lot more, right? Be donating a whole lot more, whether it's to charity. Or whether it's to uh, whatever it is, I would just like all of my like earnings from YouTube or whatever would probably just go towards like some sort of charity just to kind of uh, help them out a little bit. And then I would probably just go from there, man. Like that, to be honest with you, there's like not, there's not really much that you need to do at that point. Like you've got, you're basically set for life. You know what I'm saying? You're basically set for life. And then like, what is, what, what else is there to do, man? Like I'd probably start traveling the world a whole bunch. I'd probably, um, Hmm, like what else what else would I do like there's just there's so many freaking options of what you actually would want to do in that sort of si situation that uh, You got to kind of think about it a little bit. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> oh my gosh All right, let's get this guy right here. Let's see if he's got better armor than I do. Oh the cleanup crew the cleanup crew I ain't trying to get cleaned up right now, bro. I ain't trying to get cleaned up right now, man Why are you why is he splash potting himself when he's got freak? Oh my god. Are these guys hacking dude? Are these guys- I can't tell if these guys are hacking or not. The heck the- their- their heads are spinning all crazy like, bro. I don't even know how to feel about that. Okay, we got all that. We got all that, that. Oh! Got him. Oh my god, I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die. I can't die here. I can't die here. Come on, Mark. I can't die here. This is the last guy- oh no, there's two guys left. There's two guys left. I can't die here, Mark. Come on! Come on! Oh my god, the cleanup crew is coming. The cleanup crew is coming, dude. He's gonna try to lava me? Are you serious? Are you serious right now, buddy? Are you serious right now, buddy? Huh? Come on! There's no way you can run from fire aspect! Too OP! 
too freaking OP. Okay, all right, let's good. Let's good. Let's got prop one on there. Oh my gosh, it comes to that game point. This is the time of the game where I gotta fully freaking focus. Otherwise, I'm gonna lose. All right, put the diamond pants on. I need those better boots that I just freaking dropped because those were really, really strong freaking boots. Now here we go. We don't have any healing. That's the one thing that we need in order to win this game. We just need more healing. So let's buy some healing lucky blocks right now. Come on, give me something good, man. Give me something good to heal with. All right, that's not bad. All right, that's not bad. I'll take it. I'll take it. Here we go. All right, here we go. Last engage. He's got a little bow here. This is the guy that was camping at the beginning of the freaking game. $1.2 billion, guys. What the heck would you buy? If you had 1.2 billion dollars, let me know in the comment section below. Thank you guys so much more. Thank you guys so much for watching today's video. If you guys did enjoy, make sure you guys hit that like button. I hope I feel better, please. Oh my God, this sickness has just been going on for too long. Thank you guys for watching. This is D Field. We'll see you guys later.